All right, we are back at Hamburg St. Nicholas Church. Uh, we have played this quite a few times during the demos and early access. In full transparency, uh, in this playthrough, I have been to St. Nicholas Church twice, and it's crashed twice. <laughs> uh, but there was an update. Maybe, maybe it's fixed and we're good to go. All right, we are needed in Hamburg, the city that burned due to the Allied raids years before the front actually got there. My husband served here at the time. I wonder if he visited the church by the canal, the ruins of which I am now supposed to clear. And uh, I believe we're following Andreas and seeing uh, if he survived. Okay, right, let's start mission. Again, we're restarting because, uh, yeah. Remember the paralyzing fear I felt reading in the newspapers about the bombings of Hamburg in 1943. My Andreas' unit was stationed in the city at the time. I was worried sick for weeks, and finally a letter from Wehrmacht arrived. Andreas was severely burned, but alive. They say all the Allies wanted at the time was to stop the Nazi U-boat production. They succeeded, but at the same time, Hamburg with its inhabitants burned almost completely. When the incendiary bombs penetrated through the cellars full of coal, all hell broke loose. Now I arrive in Hamburg, witnessing the aftermath of the monstrous firestorms my husband had once encountered. During the World War II, Hamburg suffered greatly from Allies bombings. The raids were intended to destroy Nazi submarine factories on the coast, but in the end, they led to mighty firestorms and mass destruction. The St. Nicholas Church you're about to visit in-game stands in Hamburg to this day. It's never been fully rebuilt. See if we can do this. <laughs> Fingers crossed that i don't crash i uh, it was basically <laughs> and here's a funny story placing items it is giving us the tutorial even though clearly it's one of the last maps you can do it could either be your last map or your second to last map for me it's going to be the second the last map um, i chose to stick with the story of andreas um there is i believe we can go to france and uh, find the story there, and it, it's the last map to do uh, for now. Uh, the best that I can tell from the way that the map looks is that there is still plans for more maps. And I guess also what clued me into, there was a discussion on the Steam forum page, too. There was... Uh, content still uh, planned so everyone cross their fingers that they're uh, they will <laughs> yeah, see we're still getting the teaching us how to use the hammer but at this point we've uh, we've used the hammer plenty All right, let's put the rubble in my hand and kick off this uh, that scene we're gonna continue forward the ghost tank. No. Okay. All right. We're going to come back for that.
ones real quick since we're here. Weird. Quick peek. They can't see much of anything, to be honest. All right. you <laughs> all right Kind of the funny thing is both times that I was playing this, I was going pretty fast. Uh, you know, because we've done it, I think, four times now. Uh, it's not, like, particularly it was, you know, I've, I've experienced it. I know what's, what it wants me to do. And uh, I don't know if it was because of the speed that I was going at. The game was like, hold on. Too crazy for going on. A response to the request, we'll read that in a minute. There we go. Uh, if I remember right, my very last playthrough of this, I actually missed. A... I do want to make sure to go through if I can find all the notes. Bricks, which actually funny enough whole reason for doing that
part. Oh, you might hear the dogs in the background. I don't know what they're barking at. Her uh, floor away from me, but usually when I'm recording, I they aren't with me. Not always, though. Sometimes they just want to lay by my feet. And who am I to tell them no? Just save an ex. I just want to save. Can I just save? I want to save an exit. Um, we went to save because as soon as I enter that church was where I was crashing. I'm gonna save and I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. I saved. It took me to the menu and I came back. If I remember right. Sorry about breaking you. Or you're a very nice object. It made me do it.
free ladder in here. that there is a f mm, we'll Break this now. Attention all German citizens. Curfew extends from 8 p.m. to 5 a.m. unless you are otherwise authorized. Violators will be subject to interrogation and detained where necessary. Remember, it is your duty to inform the administration of the occupation zone about any signs of Nazi partisans' activity. By working together, we will tear off the werewolf's head. I don't think I ever remember uh, filling that hole in the last playthrough. Nap.
Takes you back to shore. <laughs> yeah, alright. I'm supposed to kick something into gear. Oh. There it is. I don't have any metal on me, so we'll have to come back. And so, there's a boat right down there that it's it's meaning for you to use it and go across. Um, I don't use the boat. The uh, mechanic to use it is just a bit awful. I'd rather just grab it and walk through this entryway. <laughs> Ten times quicker. Destroyed, wrecked buildings. Definitely a hazard. Rowing boat. Yeah, not happening. Not happening. In uh, one of the earlier demos, if you fell into the water, you stayed, in, like, you, you didn't drown like the way it does. Where it does the fade out and um, you're transported back to the dock. Uh, you just were in the water and you could just kind of whim walk along it did i will admit look a little dorky sure that's why they um I'm going to laugh so hard if I accidentally gather everything, all the archive stuff when the last time I couldn't. Because <laughs> I was too blind. What? Holy man achievement unlocked. Up there. One and only time we actually use this for something like this. Well. So fingers crossed, I think whatever I did that broke the game before it crashed me on this level, I think got fixed in its patch update. I didn't see it in the patch notes, but uh, maybe it wasn't 
felt that they needed to tell us. Alright, up the stairs. I'm gonna read the notes all at once. There is, uh, we've, we've been through them before, but I will. Love that they stored everything in this church up here. Tall tower, that's easily. Oh. Are you a statue or are you? He's a statue. A child's drawing. I need metal, of course. It's the thing that I didn't bring. and I guess uh, keep it cleaning stuff and then we'll grab our handfuls. I know I didn't destroy these trees the last time either, so. Halfway learning new tricks. And I know in uh, editing, I will add pictures of Hamburg as well, uh, and especially this church, because the church is indeed very, very real. Checking to see if there was any there. There wasn't. that oh we did manage to okay so whatever i missed because there's one note up in the building that we're gonna go uh, okay it took me a minute to find it but i had to uh someone had um a commenter in the last demo video I did this had translated this note for me, and it says, uh, the 3rd of August, 1943, thanks for taking mommy out of the fire. You are our hero, Corporal uh, Andreas. I hope the face will heal quickly, Stefan. So, that's, uh, is, well, we know Andreas is our, our voice actress uh, who talked in the beginning. Uh, that is her love. She was looking for him in the previous video as well. In uh, Eason, so. And she had mentioned in the beginning of this video that he was burned horribly. So now we know how how it happened. He was saving someone. And just that quickly, we are out of wood.
Da-da. Let's grab more. Yeah. Tackle that building. I'm not looking forward to it. But it wasn't so bad last time. Actually, the part I'm not looking forward to is the painting. I... So tedious. But I said that last time, too, and it went really fast. So I just need to get over myself. Do the site in a minute. Let's pop up here. I was trying to cheese it so I didn't have to put the ladder down, but... The Hunchback of Ham Hamburg. And we're... Okay. Well, in my hand. It's a fenced area. Finish. Putting in the guard rails here. Prepared them here. Fix that. All that's left now is the building. Oh, nope, I remember. This. You need it from me? No? There is there doors. You don't want to turn that on. I will, but I think I'm going to turn it right back off. Alright, 
right, we got all the secrets of Hamburg, and let's go through this. So we got the child's drawing. Um, our faithful companion. Final conclusions. The problems in detecting and identifying Allied bombers were not due to radar malfunction. Enemy planes released a cloud of pieces of aluminum that appeared on receivers as apparent targets. The first waves of demolition bombs were not the main destructive factor. Their function was to create breaches in buildings, preferably straight to the basement. The main destructive factor was the incendiary shells that got into the cracks created earlier. The civilian population had accumu accumulated large stocks of coal and other fuel in anticipation of the harsh winter and supply shortages during wartime. These stockpiles caught the fire, leading to a spike in temperature and flare-up of firestorms. Therefore, the use of the city cellars as air raid shelters turned out to be completely counterproductive. In addition, as many resources as possible should be devoted, developing a way to counteract the new... We have food stamps, British food stamps for potatoes. After carefully reviewing the application and the petition provided by Father Bernard Hiller, we decided to decline the request. Justification that has been established at the Church of St. Nicholas is not as much an important point in the city's landscape as to devote valuable resources to its reconstruction. It is decided to keep the church belfry and the remains of the nave as the memorial. The resources saved in this way will be used to strengthen the banks of the Elbe and the canals. I said that right up and to construct the housings of which there is currently critical demand. Attention! Due to the ongoing denazification process, every adult German citizen is obliged to watch films recorded by the Allied forces in the liberated Nazi concentration camp uh, located in Hamburg. The screenings will take place every day at 7 p.m., after which you will be able to obtain a certificate confirming participation in the screening. The lack of valid certificate may result in the restriction of freedoms and privileges in everyday life. Make a donation to the War Aid of the German Red Cross. And to uh, South America in three days, General Agency of Zipline Airship Construction. Berg. Uh, I think I used to be able to jump on the bed because I remember looking at that book. But it won't let me up. Around. You've seen the other playthroughs. We've, you've looked around with me four times, but... My face is in this pool. Okay. Can't go there or in there. into the bathroom. The bathroom doesn't look half bad for having a wall blown up. Shoes. Hmm. 
me attach this. Let's see what she's got. Okay. Uh, hey, new girl, this building needs more repairs. Check it out when you have time. Watch out for the broken stairs, though. It's hard to go up them. I've already thrown away broken furniture. Now I'm bringing all the paint we have left. For the facade, let's bring at least a little color to this ruined city. You ask around about that Andreas. Husband, eh? Do yourself a favor and forget about him. Act as if they confirmed his death. It's easier to move on that way. It worked for me. My cousin was in Hamburg in 43 when the raids were the heaviest. She also... Oh, she almost orphaned her son. The garrison soldier carried her out of the building... The garrison soldier carried her out of the burning apartment. God bless him. Though he's pr probably dead. Painful to see all those English soldiers here to live under their command. This army liberated his from Nazis, but also took away our husbands, fathers, brothers, and sons. You know that feeling, feeling, don't you? Let me take a breath. I, breath. I've been on my feet since dawn. Uh, the garrison carried him out of the burning apartment. God bless him, though he's probably dead by now. Guys. Move along. I don't care if you're not a soldier. Civilians like you had let those monsters act. You're all responsible. We spend our money to help the Krats. What a sick joke. That bother me or I'll boast you for collaboration with Werewolf. My colleague can be harsh. Sorry for him. Private lost all four brothers in France on top of this. His unit liberated... Uh, after all he saw and lived through, it's hard for him not to see all Germans as enemies. We were told of this country as of a collection of strategic points, resources, and enemy forces. Now that the war is over, we see what's uh, behind all of that. I'm sorry, I'm on duty. Up oh, and here, icon. I almost fell down and I wasn't ready for that. I didn't want to fall down yet. Oh, I guess that was my fault. I went up to stay down. All right, now we go up.
I was sort of hoping that Andreas would appear similar to William did. Yeah, Tony. Totally. I remember fighting with you stairs last time. Let's go make a roof and our ladder. Ah, uh, we gotta make scaffolding. It's painful to see all these English soldiers here to live under their command. This army liberated us from Nazis, but also took away our husbands. Okay, yeah. Or just, I think we only have two, but I can sell the other two, but I didn't want to be up there and not have enough. Uh, what did I say? I said I didn't want to be up there and not have enough. Oh, man. All right, we finished the main west, kind of. Let's do blue. I haven't done a blue in, uh, ever, I think. I always went with green. <laughs> or, I mean, white. sort of wish I went with white, but it's okay. Blue's colorful. It's fun. Cheerful. Welcome back. I painted the buildings like I did last time, but it was a fun blue color. I don't know if I like it or not, but we're rolling with it. All right. Start building. We could do a fountain square. We could do a cafe on a riverbank, or we can do a house. I actually am going to do the cafe on the riverbank. I just that. All right.
I remember in Eason, it wouldn't let me do this. I, I'm just holding my mouse button down and walking along. I had to click one by one. But this one here, I can just walk along while the button is clicked. So I don't know what is going on. Yes, though, you know, I really should have put the, the fountain square. Because that's the only thing I haven't done yet. <laughs> I did do the cafe the very first time I played. Uh, but I have to tell you, the reason why I wanted to was because we have those decorations for a restaurant. That I was like, it has to be that. I wonder if they considered for a minute making you put the blocks one by one, like making it a much more tedious method of building and then change their mind at the at the idea of it, or if it's always been this method. I just really like this arch here that they have going on. Wood. We built on the shore. Take a look at what we got going on. We just gotta decorate. Alright, so seat and tables. Okay. Seat and tables. Four. You do it. You did it. There's oh, jerks. So the whole reason why I did the cafe was I there was street decorations for like a cafe. And it's not here. Oh. 
Verde. There's like the menu board and I don't know what. Kind of annoyed. If I know we weren't going to get that, I would have built something else. That's you. Yes. The other thing, vegetation, I bet. this lag coming from and why won't this tree go anywhere mr. tree Big old trees covering up all the damage in the background. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, I'm not going up. I got everything. Looks like I do. Turn off.
All right, the last one on the map that we have access to as, uh, outside of the sandbox is we have Dunbrook, or excuse me, Dunkirk Beach. More than 300,000 Allied troops were evacuated from here in 1940, leaving behind tons of destroyed equipment. Then the Nazis turned the town into a fortified fortress. It will take a lot of work to bring the town back to its original condition.